Hey guys, Mike G here, and welcome back to another discussion, and this one, we are going to discuss Dragon Ball Super, a new series this July, this summer, 2015. Oh my gosh, you guys, my excitement level is way beyond over 9,000, and I feel Super Saiyan right now. Oh man, you guys, um, now... I sadly ran out of time to research, so um, I will do my best tomorrow to research for you guys to, to see if there is any information on what's going to happen during the series, on where the storyline is going to take place, does it take place after Revival of F, is this after the Boo Saga with Oob, what's going on in this series, we really, I, I, well actually I don't know at this point, so all I can really tell you right now is that there is a new series this summer, and my guess will be about somewhere about early July, a little bit later on after early July. That's what I'm going to guess it's going to come out. That's just a guess. Um, you guys might, might even know the date. But all I did is just see a glance. And I got to watch a little bit of um, Goku T23's video. Just a little bit. And that's all I really got. I didn't get to see the rest, um, sadly. And so I will do the research myself and see what, what I get. So, yeah, that's all I can really tell you, but my thoughts, man, I mean, Dragon Ball Z is probably my favorite show of all time, and, you know, yeah, it's not as perfect as Walking Dead or, you know, your Game of Thrones or anything. I don't watch those, but I do know that those were better directed and better made, but understand that it's like Godzilla with him being my favorite character of all time. You know, Dragon Ball Z is also just, um, it, it's a nostalgia, and I grew up with it, and I just love the whole entire series. Now, not every season is perfect, you know, and, you know, it's not a perfect show, but, you know, it's got my favorite TV show character of all time, which is Vegeta, and it's got fantastic characters, it's, it's just great, you know, it's a fun series, and, you know, it's one of the greatest cartoons of all time, and probably, in my opinion, the greatest anime ever, and, uh, it's just such a great show, it's, it's definitely my favorite, and, you know, I've been waiting for a series for a long time since I was a kid, you know, I was just waiting to see if there was anything new, and I just kind of gave up, you know, because they stopped, and then when the movies came out, you know, I was like, man, dude, I forgot all about Dragon Ball, I watched all the movies again, I watched the whole entire series, yes, this year, I finally got to finish all of it from, um, from, from late 2014 to this point, I finished the whole entire series, and it's been fantastic, so, I'm really pumped to see a series with better graphics and, you know, what direction they're going to go now since, you know, we have so much more to go with, you know. The, the movies have proved me that Akiri Toriyama, um, as disappointed as some people are, it still goes on strong and the characters are still great and Dragon Ball still works today. It, it's amazing how well Dragon Ball is aged. And it's great that they actually are taking the chance to make a new series, and um, and I'm just so happy about that as well, too. So yeah, um, if you want to subscribe for more Godzilla, Dragon Ball, and Alien, go on ahead and do so. Comment, like, and subscribe for more today. Mike G off your screen. I'll see you guys soon in the next video. See you guys soon.